Hey guys, this is Josh, and we have a new arrival, English Bulldog. What's her name? Lucy. Lucy? I love that name. Lucy, and she's here for three weeks. We're working on um, her basic obedience, obviously, on English, and things like this. This is the man barking right now, but she also startles into some form of aggression if she's sleeping. And when she recognizes somebody she knows, she comes back. That's because she's living on edge in her, in this, in her state of mind. So the concept that I want you guys to get, even with your dogs at home, any dog really, is you want to see how they deal with stress. Okay, that's the big one. You talk to somebody about their dog, even people who drop their dogs off here for severe issues, we always find a point where they're talking about how good the dog is. And that's great. That's great, but that's not what we're concerned about here. We're not concerned about the dog being good when it's happy, okay? Because that's easy. It's like saying, hey, I'm happy today, so I'm having a good day. Duh, of course I am, I'm happy. What happens when I'm not happy? What happens when I'm extremely stressed, anxious, living on edge, and then a bunch of things in my day happen that, that, that push me even further? What do I do? How do I respond while I'm in this edgy state of mind to my environment? if things aren't going my way. That's what I'm concerned about. So I'm concerned to see how she deals with stress, whatever that looks like, whatever causes stress. Right now, being on this tie back here is causing stress. This is what I'm concerned about. I'm concerned about changing her response to the stress. I want her to relax and be patient rather than impatient, edgy, and kind of ready to rock, right? Ready to throw down. So <clears throat> that's what we're looking at when we see dogs come in. Any dog that comes in, how are you going to deal with stress? All right, so this is what we need to do. We need to teach her all the commands, just like every other dog. We need a form of communication. I need to be able to tell her to do something and she understands what I'm saying. We need to clean that up so that we can have a clear communication. And then I'm gonna use that communication to tell her how I think she should be behaving from, now, from here on out, okay? And we got three weeks to do it. And then we get this dog in a good place, we get her react reacting properly, we start rewiring her reaction to triggers that of hers to stress and then we keep the, we teach the owner how to fill this leadership role and to continue making progress going home okay